Good evening, and welcome to the public information meeting for the design of the St. John's River to Sea Loop Trail along Myrtle Avenue from 10th Street to Lytle Avenue in New Smyrna Beach. Elio Joseph is the Florida Department of Transportation's project manager for this project. Brad Bocknick is the project consultant working with the Florida Department of Transportation on this project. The purpose of tonight's meeting is to share information about the proposed project, to answer questions, and hear any concerns or feedback from you. If you have not received the project information flyer, please feel free to take one from the sign-in table. This meeting is being held to afford all citizens the opportunity to learn about this project and comment on their concerns to the Department of Transportation and to comply with Title VI of the Civil Rights Act of 1964. Public participation is solicited without regard to race, color, national origin, age, sex, religion, disability, or family status. Persons wishing to express their concerns relative to FDOT compliance with Title VI may do so by contacting Jennifer Smith. FDOT District 5 Title VI Coordinator by phone at 386-943-5367 or via email at jennifer.smith2 at dot.state.fl.us or the State Title VI Coordinator Jacqueline Paramore by phone at 850 850- 414-4753 or via email at jacqueline.paramore at dot.state.fl.us All inquiries or complaints will be handled according to FDOT procedures in a prompt and courteous manner. For the latest project information, please visit www. Dot cflroads.com. This website was created by the Florida Department of Transportation to keep you and the public informed of ongoing and future projects. On the main page, there are tabs at the top. A drop-down menu appears by selecting the Future Projects tab. By choosing Volusa from the list of counties, a new page will appear with a list of projects for this county. The interactive map located at the top of the page can be used to search for the project, or it can be selected based upon the project name and financial ID number 439864-1 St. John's River to Sea Loop Myrtle Avenue from 10th Street to State Road 44, also known as Lytle Avenue. Upon selection, the project page will appear. This project is part of the St. John's River to Sea Loop Trail, the longest multi-use loop trail in the southeastern United States, and when completed, will be 260 miles long through nine Florida counties. Over half of this trail is already either constructed or in design, and the Myrtle Avenue Trail Project is an important link in completing the loop. This project includes 1.2 miles of trail construction along Myrtle Avenue in New Smyrna Beach. The project begins at 10th Street and ends at Lytle Avenue, which is also known as State Road 44. These images represent the existing conditions along Myrtle Avenue. Currently, there is an 8-foot wide sidewalk along Myrtle Avenue. Between 10th Street and Joel Street, the sidewalk is on the west side of the roadway. From Joel Street to Lytle Avenue, the sidewalk is on the east side of the roadway. Much of the existing sidewalk is in need of repair, and utilities obstruct the walkway in several locations. These images represent the proposed conditions along Myrtle Avenue. As part of this project, the existing 8-foot wide sidewalk will be removed, and a new 12-foot wide multi-use trail will be constructed. The new trail will be on the same side of the roadway as the sidewalk is today. 
between 10th Street and Joel Street, the multi-use trail will be on the west side of the roadway. And from Joel Street to Lytle Avenue, the multi-use trail will be on the east side of the roadway. The new trail will be a minimum of five feet from the edge of the roadway and free of obstructions. In addition to the construction of the new trail, pavement striping will be replaced or added where needed. The crosswalk striping at Joel Street will be replaced where the multi-use trail crosses the road. Similarly, new striping will be provided where the new multi-use trail crosses the entrances to New Smyrna Beach Middle School and at 7th Street and Ensley Lane. The multi-use trail is being designed to avoid impacting the historic tree near Ensley Lane. The full length of the trail and related improvements are shown on the project boards on display at the meeting tonight. We encourage you to look at the project boards and ask any questions you may have. Design plans for this project were initiated in October of 2017 and are anticipated to be completed in March of 2023. This project is funded for construction, with construction anticipated to begin in the fall of 2023. The estimated construction cost of this project is $1.78 million. Your input is important to us. Comment sheets are available if you would like to provide a written comment to the department. You may submit your comment tonight, or if you prefer, you may mail us your comments. The mailing address is provided at the bottom of the comment form. You may also provide your comments electronically. The email address is provided on the comment form. Please be sure to mail or otherwise submit your comments by August 19, 2019. Thank you for attending tonight's meeting. If you have any questions or comments, you may contact Elio Joseph, the FDOT project manager by phone at 386-943-5388 or via email at elio.joseph at dot.state.fl.us or Bradley D. Bachnick project consultant by phone at 386-872-7794 or via email at bradb at newkirk-engineering.com.